It's certainly a bad week to be without heat, and luckily our In Your Corner team was able to help step in and help a woman who had her power cut off just days before these frigid temps arrived. 81-year-old Frances Archer had her power shut off this morning. Now, her husband passed away in 2020, and now all she has is her Social Security check to help pay the bills. Frances says she pays og &E around $200 a month, but still owes more than $300, prompting the shutoff. And I didn't think they could do that when it's freezing cold, but I guess I'm wrong. Our In Your Corner team reached out to og &E asking if they could delay the shutoff with the cold temperatures expected later this week. And within hours, Frances got a call telling her that her payment plan has been restructured and her power was turned back on. And then after we originally aired this story, what, at 4 o'clock, mm -hmm. we had a number of Channel 4 viewers call us offering to help. There are so many good Oklahomans out there, Channel 4 viewers, but the first to reach out was a family in Yukon. Not only did they pay the bill in full, they added some extra payment to help Miss Archer in the future. So we went back to make sure her lights were back on and to tell her the good news. We actually have somebody, a viewer, after they saw the story today, they called in the station and asked if they can pay for you. Is there anything that you would like to say to them? Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Again, they paid that bill in full. And I think I, Nick, um, in, in talking with this woman, I don't, I don't think she quite understood how kind someone was to actually pay all of her bill and then some. But I think we, I think we got it, finally got it through to her, bless her heart. I know it, and it's, oh. it's such a great thing for people to do because it's going to get so cold and Miss Archer needs some heat. If you need somebody in your corner, give us a call on our In Your Corner hotline or send us a message on our website.